I got a new lens. Three days until I turn 20. Woo! And we got all these essential oils. Cause hey guys. Damn, look how good that looks. It looks like a professional movie that like they tried to like make. Like a documentary. But they tried to make look like it was just like, an average camera they were using, you know? No. Documentary of Sonali and Ryan. Joe. I got a new lens and I literally could not be any happier. It literally looks like my big camera, which this could also be a little bit bad because I might abandon my big camera a little bit, but I'm gonna use it for like pictures and everything. So like, I don't think that will change, but look how good this quality is. Happy early birthday to me. It zooms in more once you press film. What'd you order me? I got her a hot fudge sundae with extra fudge, and there has to be a little bit of fudge on the bottom. <laughs> the other half has to be on top. She knows you didn't cheap them. <laughs> she has a lot of ice cream, and she just mixes it up and just has chocolate ice cream. <laughs> guys, last time they literally ripped me off. What's the date? It is. Hey guys. It's <laughs> September 22nd. Let's go. I'm all if you don't already know me. Three days until I turn 20. Woo! <laughs> we are. Going on a little hike. It's my first like whole day back. I got back yesterday and I actually got a lens. I didn't vlog a whole lot yesterday because I feel like traveling days are just not very exciting. But I am also very backed up on a lot of vlogs. Um, so I think I'm gonna post like two a day or something because I want my birthday vlog to go up like ASAP Rocky. Yeah, I have a lot of vlogs coming for you guys. I am so excited to see all these colorful trees. I don't get this in Florida. And I don't get this either. Look how cute you are. Let me get an outfit of the day, bae. This face a little tight on me now. These are uh, Tommy Hilfiger. Hey. These guys are pretty crispy. Um, <laughs> This is a Mossy Oak shirt. This is really old. This has to be like the 80s. Mm -hmm. um, it's cute. Some red bands. You're cute. Um, I actually really like this like jerry curl thing you got going on. Curl. I don't know. You look like the guy from Greece. It's like nice. a little curly thing on your head. <laughs> I have wavy hair if I don't shower and stuff. And I have new balances on. Just because I don't care to get crusty ass. I wear true grit. You wear it for a reason now. Yay! You guys always ask me where I got this jacket. Literally every time I wear it, everyone's like, oh my god, that looks so cozy. Where'd you get it? Um, it is True Grit. And you can buy it in a lot of boutiques here in Georgia. Um, but I don't know if they have it still because they probably sold out already. I literally bought it in August because I knew they were going to sell out. They have a website, but like every time you search it, all these boutiques come up before it. So like, I don't know. I don't know what the exact website is, but it's called True Grit. So, my True Grit, I have my, let's see, got some makeup right there. Katie Fidel Homecoming long sleeve shirt, blue lemon leggings, brown Uggs. I haven't worn my Uggs in forever. I forgot about my Uggs. And for all you haters out there calling these the ugliest shoes in the world, I don't care because they act as a purse and they're so comfy and they keep my feet warm. <laughs> okay, stop. Hey! <laughs> I'm on my way to Flying Biscuit and I literally go here every single time I'm home and I'm going with Hannah. Today is probably going to be a day full of cooking. I don't even know what I'm going to cook yet because tomorrow we're going to go to my family friend's house, me and my sister are, and um, we kind of want to bring something just to like say we made, I don't know, and like have fun like baking or something because all we really need to bring is um, drinks like sodas and stuff. That's what she told us but we want to make a dessert because that's like the fun part, like making the dessert, I don't know. <laughs> so I pinned a lot of stuff on my Pinterest last night. I feel like there's a hair in my mouth. And 
I don't know which one I'm going to pick, but they're, they all look so good. I literally want to make them all. Like, I want to have my own Thanksgiving just so I could, like, make everything, even though I, like, literally can't cook. But in my mind sometimes, I think I can cook. I don't know. I can't, though. <laughs> With Hannah. And this is my food. I pour it all evenly. <laughs> finished product. Got my grits. These grits are literally the best things in the world. Do you agree? This is my first time having it. It's like amazing. Really? Yeah, I've never had this. It's like oh really my bad. god. Yeah, they're really good. Can I have this thing cools drinks. Daddy yes. said. It's like a cooler in here. Yeah, why are you look, listening to country? Yeah. And I turned it on. <laughs> we are going to Zyka's, which is like the Indian restaurant we used to always go to when we were little. My dad ordered food from the whole restaurant. This is the best ever. It's chicken 65. I love it. Let me see your spices you got. What'd you get these for? Um, just to make things. Okay, we're getting mainly. Azuka. Cana de azuka. Si, si. Cana de azuka. So we went to the Indian grocery store and we got all these essential oils because we really wanted to try them out and they were like $3.49 each. So we got rosemary oil, lavender oil, castor oil because I heard that's like really good for like growing hair. Eyebrow lady messes it up and then you can always grow it back out with castor oil, tea tree oil, sweet almond oil. Is that it? Do you have one? Oh. oh. She got this turmeric and argan oil um, soap bar thing. Is that it? Mm -hmm. On our way to Thanksgiving lunch. <laughs> I feel like it's always dinner, but nobody ever really does Thanksgiving dinner, you know? Um, We're just really hungry, so no. we eat before. I know. Ryan's family does it at noon, too. I don't know. I, could, I couldn't wait. Like, seeing everyone else eat so early, I couldn't wait. We're going to our family friend's house, and we get to see all our friends from childhood. I feel like I literally haven't seen them in forever. One of my friends went studying abroad this summer, so I didn't see her all summer and this whole semester. What food are you most excited for? I'm really worried because our favorite chef will not be there <laughs> in attendance. Yeah. One of our family friends, um, my best friend's mom, cooks the best green bean casserole she and everything. everything. Basically, like, she's just the best She's, chef like, a really world. good baker, too. Yeah, she, she makes, made... like, chocolate cake for my birthday. Yeah. So, um, but I hope there's green bean casserole because I can swim in it. I know. I feel like every time I get a little bit 
and I regret it right after. I'm like, you know what? I should have just gotten like pounds of it while I could. Because we have like about like, I feel like there's about like 40 people, just yeah, kidding. It's probably like at least 20 people and way more than 20. I don't know. It just depends on every year. But yeah. so, so we always go and we can go first because we're kids, even though I'm 23, but <laughs> don't tell anyone. I'm still a kid to them. Um, but so then we get our plate, but we don't fill it up because we feel bad, but then there's nothing left. Yeah. I, I always want to take like leftovers home with me because I always crave it after Thanksgiving too. Look at this out here taking pics. So fun. <laughs> this is Myrna. Hi. My best childhood friend. <laughs> it's really close up because we're taking pictures. I know. Of my that nice was like friend, very close. So. <laughs> I was like, why is my entire face there? Now what do I do? <laughs> that looks good, whatever you're doing. Oh, you let me laugh, boy, what you know? Move us, boy.